Hey, welcome back to Larry's Library. And we are back in the unboxing room after a little bit. I'm gonna call this my October unboxing and haul because I'm on a sane budget now. So it's, these are gonna be less likely uh, in intervals. So here we are and I got a box from IST, instocktrades.com. The best in the business, no affiliation, but I welcome it. We got, wow, just slammed my mic. I'm sure that was not pleasant for you people with headphones, yeah? <laughs> Big old layer of bubbles. Invoice. And you see how these are all lining the box, nice. Lining the books, rather. And first one out of the gate is Avengers Omnibus. This is volume five. How's that light look, okay? Excited to get this. I am collecting all of these Avengers Omnibuses as far as uh, the original series. I used to have issues, uh, the single issues, one through, let's see, I had uh, 138 or so, all the way to 300 at one point, and I sold off a lot of those to start buying these Omnis. So I am replacing a lot of these, and of course, I have one through four. I think I need one in there. And it's about to be reprinted, so I'll get that. I think issue or I'll, volume two or three I'm missing. I forget. But anyway, I'll. Uh, so I've been able to get the ones that I could never afford, also in you know in singles, of course. Next up, we got Hellboy Library Edition, volume five. And unlike most of the books, I get most of Omnis and larger hardcovers. I will take the wrap off and stretch the spines and make sure there's no damage. You know, I'll turn it upside down if it's something I haven't read yet, so that way I'm not spoiled too much. But the problem here is uh, these Hellboy Library Editions have this fabric-y, um, this really old-fashioned fabric covers, and they attract pet hair like mad. So I'm probably actually gonna leave this in the wrap. I'm gonna pull a Kristen on this one and leave it in the wrap on the shelf until I read it. I think I only need one more Hellboy Library Edition to have them all. I think I've out one maybe. Now, this particular in stock trades box does not have the cardboard insert, but they've done a good job with lining the entire thing vertically with these bubbles. So, works just as well. And this is the long-awaited for me Daredevil, Garden Devil uh, Gallery Edition. Now this is a maybe a triple dip, definitely a double dip for me because I have the uh, Joe Quesada Marvel Knights uh, um, Omnibus. It has this story in it. This is the Kevin Smith story with art by uh, Joe Quesada and it is wonderful. I love this story and I especially love the art and it's going to be spectacular to have it in this huge superior gallery edition format so love that yeah let me give you another shot of what this looks like see they've got panels basically of the bubble wrap and they've formed it where the books couldn't move at all so that's high class whether they have the new cardboard inserts or the total bubble wrap or the old-fashioned gray foam InStock Trades just does it, and they do it well. So, there you go. So, let's see. Give you a shot of all of these. And that is my haul for October. Hope you like that. See you next time.